Hey Pisces, welcome to your WLC Weekly Love Connections reading. This will be for those of you who are wanting to get insights with regards to your love connections. To all my subscribers, thank you for your continued support. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. All right, Pisces, let's see what we have for you for this week. Story for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising Venus and Jupiter, love, first card out, five of cups, at the bottom of the deck we have the Emperor. Okay, so Pisces. All right, so you've gone quiet. You've gone quiet, yeah, in, in this situation. I feel that this is you. You probably have, um, you know, stopped communicating or just stopped stop um, wondering if there's ever be that sort of communication honest communication you can have with someone in terms of your past yeah i feel this is a, a very it's it's an energy that you have with someone yeah it feels like it's a past person that you have dealt with somebody that may have disappointed you several times Somebody who may have shown you, sometimes they may have shown you that it's good to be around each other, for both of you to be happy, to enjoy the day and things like that. But on other times, they also look for other happiness to, to other in other people. Yeah. Well, there's no problem if um, you're all friends. Yeah. But if we're talking about romantic connection then that poses some disappointments yeah feels like this person may have may have played a little bit in terms of how you feel yeah somebody who knows that um you have feelings for them um and probably did not really handle it quite well yeah because for this connection i am seeing that there's somebody here who is um having a lot of regrets or just not happy with how things turned out yeah for you Pisces I could see that um, well for the most part you are still into this connection that's why it's showing up um, in this spread right now you're still thinking about this connection and um, you haven't let go yeah, you haven't let go of this connection and some at some, some point in time if another chance would come in i feel that you're still willing to put an effort into this mm -hmm. but it also also i'm also getting that um despite this disappointment you have with someone you're also kind of thinking is there a way for you to be happy is there any other way yeah not just focusing much on this person I feel that you are trying to find other ways that could make you happy that could make you satisfied fulfilled emotionally perhaps yeah and I feel that if only an idea would come to mind if only when you get into those dating sites and you found one that could actually tickle your fancy I feel that you're willing to go for it too. Yeah, that's what I'm getting. That's what I'm getting. Because this situation you have here, it feels like you have been waiting for this for quite a while to get it into a more stable front. But you have grown twigs in your head. You know, you've grown horns and yet nothing is happening. And now you still find 
yourself thinking about is there any way is there any other way that you can fix it so it feels like you've been trying to fix the situation over and over again and yet you're not getting into to a state of a um a well done uh connection a connection that works for you a connection that can truly make you happy so yeah i see you kind of venturing into you know other ways other means other people that possibly could if there's only one thing that could tell you hey pisces i can make you happy i think you want to go for that yeah i think you want to go for that because however things have happened between you and this person it feels like or however your connection your current connection is is happening right now it feels like it's just too overwhelming yeah emotionally and and you're you're just disappointed a lot of disappointments here now the person that you have in mind the person that you have in mind pisces i feel this is someone who for the well primary thing i could say is that this person knows their value yeah somebody who knows what they can offer who knows what they want and somebody who knows their value and i feel that this is someone who wouldn't settle with just about anything and also if they want something if they really really want something if they really really want um relationship or any dreams they have in life this is someone who would be willing to work for it mm -hmm. this person in terms of confidence in terms of um, direction in life they got it internally though internally this person knows what they want the type of relationship they want they know that but it's it's a matter of it's internal they know it for themselves but they may not be sharing it to other people so what you see outside of this person you may feel you may see the um the passionate side of this person you may see that this person can be enticing yeah, can be charming, can be, you know, somebody who is really attractive. But that's the external features, yeah. Internally, though, this person really knows what they want and what they are capable of. So, if this person really wants you or wants this connection, they'll go for it. Yeah. Um, but for now, I see this person being just being carefree yeah they know that they have to make a decision about about something it could be about this relationship but there is something here something's telling me that this person knows they got to make a decision um with regards to a relationship but somehow this person is not making that move or that that decision just yet maybe they're they're, they're i feel like they're planning it in their head they got it in their head it's just that when are they going to make a decision when are they going to put the sword down and make that decision so that they can start acting on that decision right they can start taking steps to to follow up on that decision so in terms of um, them making the decision I feel that in their mind it's it's there now it's you know they're just thinking about you know what are they gonna do when are they gonna do it yeah because ultimately i see this person making the decision anyway we have justice here and it feels like this is someone who make who wants to make the right decision for this situation you have they may be afar from you right now i feel you may not even be talking you may not even be you may even be blocked from each other yeah but this person has that passion that desire that has not been expressed yeah and i do feel that soon enough they would be expressing it once they make a decision on what they want out of this connection with you yeah 
um, apart from passion, I feel that this connection as well, this has been a loving connection in the past. There's been some love shared and, and feelings shared towards one another. Uh, but at this moment, I feel that both of you knows that, or both of you know that you still have that love for one another. But are you going to offer it to each other? That's the big question there. It feels like you both can feel the love, the compassion, but you are not also talking about it to each other. You are not sharing how you feel towards each other, at least for now. You're kind of looking at it from afar too. You know how I feel? It's more like you have a situation with someone and then both of you have departed from that connection and both of you are just looking from outside. And then trying to see, is this still fixable? You know, both of you are looking at this connection. It is as if you're not part of it. And it's more about you now thinking, more about you now um, wondering how you feel right now, how you think about the current situation. It's like you're being a third party here. Yeah. But the feelings between each other, it's still, I mean, the feeling is still there. It's just that, are you going to share it out? Are you going to be opening it up? Yeah. But at some point, somebody here will. <laughs> somebody here will. Because there is that sense that somebody here has been waiting for um, a reunification, reuniting. Yeah. And somebody here, whoever is the one really thinking about this situation, about your connection, that person, I feel, is, is, is planning yeah, on how to make this right. You have the emperor here. He's really thinking hard on how are they going to make it right. So if it's your partner, they're thinking about how are they going to make it right with you. If this is you, over, I mean, still very much thinking about the situation, I feel that you will um, likely offer this cup to this person. You're probably thinking right now how to how, how what's the best way to approach them again mm -hmm. but nevertheless something here is going to be offered the knight of cups at the center of the reading yeah and that offering comes with it um fixing what has been broken fixing the disappointments that has been um done yeah and ultimately I feel that this can still be worked out yeah you will feel you you will find yourself work working things out with one another you have the three of pentacles so this can still be worked out yeah that's what i feel i'm gonna leave it at that pisces and then let me know if this resonates in the comment section below and don't forget to hit like and subscribe